take two. All right, guys, welcome to a video. <laughs> I got downed on round two last attempt at this, so we're trying it again. Uh, I didn't even leave the first room, if that tells you how bad the attempt was. You cannot buy quick revive, we learned that. And I trapped myself in between these couches like an idiot. Probably shouldn't have, but it's what I did. And it went poorly. So, I don't get the best frame rate when I record playing this, um, but that's to be expected. My computer's decent, it's just not good. Um, sometime in the future, I'll get a better computer, but at least I have one instead of... I don't know if you guys have been subscribers on my channel for a long time, but I, my computer broke a while back and I had to buy this one, which is better than the old one, but it's... You know, still not good. It was just kind of a last-minute purchase because, you know, I didn't want to save up money any longer. I was getting impatient with not having a computer and having to use the family computer. So, you know, things just go like that. Uh, I want to talk a little bit about something. I have pretty bad social anxiety. Talking to people is just really not advised for me. I don't enjoy talking to people, I never will, probably, but making YouTube videos is kind of like a therapy for me. It's like, I'm talking to people indirectly, and it shows me that talking to people isn't all that bad. And so I just want to say that, that's probably about 50% of the reason I have a YouTube channel, and then the other 50% is just because I love video games, as anybody who's watching this probably is, because, you know, what's not to like about video games? Is this a door? That should be a door. That'd be, oh, hold up, hold up. <laughs> it is a door. Alright, we might have to retreat upstairs here soon, so let's be ready. You know, I have plenty of ammo in the gear. Let's open this door if I can without being killed. Please die. Alright, let's head down here. Ah, we have Juggernog. Uh, from the description I read, there is absolutely no wall weapons except for the one I've got in my hand. And that's just to get you out of the first room. So we have to find the box quick. The power must be... Oh, I think this, that's the other part of the teleporter. It's like custom skinned. I've seen other maps with it. Alright. So this is door, it looks like. 2K. Is the front door a door? I don't know. Is there a zombie counter? There's not a zombie counter. I already know that. This is not a door, but we're... <sighs> Last attempt, I noticed a glitch. I looked out a window, and I saw the box, question marks, through the ground. It was right out there. I don't know if I'm going to be able to see that this time. Ah, uh, yes, right there. So we need to... Let's kind of map it out. It's this way, so behind us now. Alright, so it would be through this door, probably. Alright, so we're going to need to take a stand somewhere. Let's turn on the power, because we can why not? Alright, let's take this guy out. I don't know if they're going to spawn down here. That'd be a good thing to know. They probably are, because if they aren't, that's kind of dumb. If they all spawn in one place, it makes for a pretty bad map, actually. <laughs> I'd say, so we'll just stand at the bottom of the stairs, probably. And just hope none spawn? I... Whoa! I... <laughs> I thought this was a zombie. I was like, whoa, they do spawn down here and somehow die. But nope. It's just a corpse. Nothing odd. Nothing that wouldn't be in a normal basement. You know. Too stupid to quit. That's what they are. 
we can do a little bit of training down here. Not much. It won't work too well. Oh, look at this. Let's open the door, because we can. There we go. We can get a new gun now. And then we can save for Juggernog. So I haven't seen them spawn anywhere except for over there. Trench gun, not bad. I'm not going to complain about that. Yeah, I'm not seeing them spawn anywhere else. That's unfortunate. That's one thing the mod creator could do to make this map better. However, the details, you know, it's okay. The walls are a bit fuzzy. That just might be me because my uh, graphic settings are really low, though. So, I'm not going to criticize for graphics because, you know, I'm one to speak. Oh, they do spawn down here. Cool. It's not a terrible map. Oh, that was a close one. That was a wasted shot. Oh, I need jug. Can I walk back to here? Oh, I can. Alright, good. Training is pretty difficult in this map, I'll be quite honest. I I wish there was a more wide open space I could find. There might be. I haven't explored the whole map yet. Alright, let's hit up Jug. Speed Cola speeds up your life. Wrong song. Alright, I'm going to assume the story is 200. 200? 2,000? Because that's, yeah, that's all they've been on this map. We might want to save up for a new weapon again. Full auto would be preferred right now. Doesn't kill as strong, but you know, with the points. Oh, there's dog rounds. That's good to know. Where do they spawn in? friend you're my best friend cuz I'm a man looks like they're only spawning up there for now hey taking a detour yeah looks like that's the only place they're spawning let's replace the gear even though we have ammo now let's replace it it's no good in these rounds MP40. Alright, that's good. That's good. I'm not gonna complain. Uh, yeah, let's not go up there. Ill advised, I do presume. This window's really high up. <laughs> that's weird. Alright. So there is Pack-a-Punch on this map. I do not know where it is. I do not know where anything is. Except for what I have found so far in this video. So... I'm kind of going into this blind. I have not played through the map. Uh, I kind of like it that way. I know people who watch it on YouTube, they know nothing about the map. Unless course they're like map creator or something or they've played it in which case why are you watching it just go play it um so i know part of the experience is discovering everything and if you don't have the game you can't really do that you can't discover something that you don't know it's there like 
<coughs> Excuse me. I got a bit of a cold, I think. Is this, oh, this is a door. We can do, like, a full loop. I think... Actually, I think that goes up to Pack-a-Punch, probably. But anyway, it's better when it's all explored fresh. That's weird. Graphic glitch. I'm gonna assume they spawn up here. Is this a good place to run circles? Can I jump over this? I can. This could be a good place to run circles. I guess we'll find out. Ultimately. Yeah, that graphic glitch. That could drive me crazy. So again, as I said at the beginning of the video, if you guys like this video, you should actually hit that like button, because it really means a lot to me. Um, uh, this is my first World at War zombie video. It's my first zombie video, period. And I just love playing it, and I hope you guys love watching it. And if you do, it really helps me out if you hit that like button. So, always feel free. Um, honestly, I think if you hit the like button, it would mean more than me, more to me than subscribing, because I think it really emphasizes on a video more than subscribing does. I mean, you can tell people your subscribers know that you subscribe to me, but then. Or they can know that you liked a video, and it's a little bit more prominent when you like a video than when you subscribe, so. Alright, we're gonna hit up Speed Cola here soon. It'll be nice for the trench. I should be getting more points with the MP40, so. We've got enough, let's hit it up. There we go. Get that fast reload. Alright, let's test it out in just a sec. Did I get two drops? Dang. I'm lucky. Alright, reload. Oh, yeah. Three? Four? Holy cow! Did that just happen? <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen that happen before. I'm not gonna complain. But I don't think I've ever seen it happen. So now we need 2,000? Yes, I should have expected that. I'm glad they don't spawn up here. It makes it easy. Yeah, there's Pack Punch. I can see it. Alright. Boom! I could have knifed him, but I didn't. Okay, MP40. <coughs> Round 9, and I could really go for a pack-punched weapon. The guns I have now will do the trick, they're just not preferred. I've noticed uh, a trend in zombie maps lately is your ability to spin a box for like 5,000 points and get an upgraded weapon. I think that's actually really cool. I think that's better than the actual pack-a-punch machine, because otherwise you know what you're getting and it's just like, yeah. But if you get a random pack-a-punched weapon, it's still a gamble, and you know, that's part of what makes a challenge makes it more of a challenge if you don't know what you're getting. Which is part of the reason I like Shinanuma. Um, you don't know what perk you're getting, so it could be like round 12 before you get Juggernaut. Juggernog. So, it really puts more of a challenge on the game when you have that. And I, I enjoy a challenge. The challenge is always fun. It's what makes a game replayable. Rechallenge and enjoyment. The two factors I see that are the most important in game development. Speaking of game development, I'm going to be taking a programming class next year, and so maybe after the school years... Oh, oh, this could be the end. Who run, 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 run. Oh, that was a close one. I could have very easily went down there. Especially without uh, Black Ops Quick Revive. Speed Cola speeds up your life. I love that jingle. That's like my favorite. Maybe Jug, though. Jug's got a good one. And then there's Deadshot that goes all out on their special one. All of them are like, you know, kind of, you know, like jazzy, or a few of them are westerny, and then there's Deadshot, and it's like, 
rock music. Okay, that's the second time I've gotten stuck in that flower pot thing. Oh, let's see if we can get a crawler. Uh, oh, that was a bad throw. Oh, ouch. Yeah, we don't want to get a nuke. Please, no. Dang it. Open it quick. Open it quick. Alright, I'm just going to make sure we unlocked all the way up. Yeah, but I don't want to be up there. I'll be in my training area if you need me. A new weapon would be nice. If we can get a crawler this round, it would be much appreciated. Oh yeah, MP40 is not doing the trick very much anymore. When I look this way, I get a little bit of lag. More than, more so than when I go other ways. Boom, boom, get pepper sprayed. Pepper sprayed. Get peppered with bullets. Don't get pepper sprayed. Alright. What would happen if you tried to use pepper spray on a zombie? <laughs> that could be interesting. Oh. Ooh, you can jump over that. That's going to be handy. Probably. If I'm running this way and they're coming out the door, I can go where they can't. Alright. Round 10, I'm actually pretty happy I made it here. I'm not the best zombie here, so... Nor will I ever admit to being a good one. I'm pretty mediocre when it comes to training. I don't want to try to get a crawler yet, but maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna. Boom! Switch to the trench. Alright, this is still a one hit, to the best of my knowledge. Alrighty, we're doing good. Ooh, what is that? Insta kill, sure, we'll get it. And we'll finish him off with the MP40. Oop! I think there was a crawler behind me. Or there's more spawning. I think there's more spawning. Hoop! That's a lot of hoopla. Okay, yeah, these crawlers won't be any fun, I don't think. I think these are the last ones. Let's kill the fast ones. And then I'll see if maybe we can get a decent gun. I want to keep 5,000 though so I can, I can pack a punch. Ooh. I don't really want this. Bad decision. I shouldn't have picked it up. I'm going to kill just one of them. Not enough. Darn. Alright, well, I'm gonna pack a punch the trench. Let's do it. I think we have all the perks, to the best of my knowledge, now. I think we've unlocked the whole map. It's pretty. It's a pretty decent map. Um, gut shot. I like the camo on this. It's beautiful. So, Black Ops 3 hype, huh? I probably honestly won't be getting it, because I don't have an X-Gen console, which is unfortunate, but... Oh, we haven't done anything with teleporters yet. Maybe we should do that. Ooh, dogs. I wonder if they... They should spawn up there. Like, where are they going to spawn? I don't think they're going to spawn anywhere new. It's kind of dumb, to be honest. Accuracy, David. Holy cow, I need accuracy. <laughs> I am not doing too hot. Holy cow, is... 
Is the gunshot bad? Holy cow. Maybe the double bar barrel is going to be the way to go. Holy cow, these guys just have a lot of health. Wow. This is pack a punched trench gun, and it's doing nothing. Then again, I think part of that's I'm missing a lot, <laughs> but. Holy cow. Alright, let's hit the box again. Ooh, browning. I'm fine with that. I think these might be the two weapons to go with. This looks like a door, is it? It is not a door. It should be. This should still be a one hit, especially since it's pack punch now. Oh yeah, easy. Yeah, I lag when I look this way. I get only 10 frames. Only when I look in this direction. It's really weird. Like, I'm getting 20 now, and then I look this way, and it's just like 10. Thanks. 16. 10. It's not much of a difference, but it's a visible difference, so... Let's try out the browning. Reloading is fine with this, especially since I have speed cola. Alright, let's just do some training, get them all up in a group, and then s turn around and spray. Alright, I think we're doing pretty good. We should set a round goal, though. I don't want to keep this video going till I die, because, you know, I don't know when that'll be. Um... Maybe we'll say, like, 16, because otherwise it's just repetitive. It's me training with guns that get progressively more and more powerful, depending on the round. So, I don't really want this to be all that repetitive. Yes, you are, Dempsey. Are these the last two? I think they are. Hey, fool. You want to do that again? No. It's the only answer I'll take. Alright. We're doing pretty solid, I think. This is a good place to train. I think we should try to get a crawler this round and link the teleporter. Yeah, we can pack a punch and link to the mainframe this round if we get crawlers. Oh. Once we get the points, that is, I'm sure we'll get there. If you can reload, reload. That's my number one tip if you're pretty new to zombies. You never be caught with an unloaded weapon. If you have the ammo to reload, just reload if you can. It's beneficial when you're in a corner and you need to get out of a corner. 
especially with the shotgun. If it's not loaded all the way you want it to be full auto and you're stuck in a corner, you're kind of in a bad way. You might be screwed royally. Oh, I did not mean to get that. That's unfortunate. Is that going to kill all of them? Or just some? I don't want the round to finish, is what I'm saying. No, they spawning. I'm gonna try to get a crawler. That grenade could have easily killed me. That was a bad grenade throw. Come on. There we go. Nice. This is the last guy, I do believe. Alright, let's initiate Link. I don't think I've ever heard Dempsey say that. I haven't really listened, though, so that could be the problem. Alright, so how much is this? If it's 1500 I don't want it. Yeah, it's 1500 Um, I can't afford Pack Punch if I double tap, so we'll just go for Pack Punch. Hey, buddy. I missed you. I did. I really did. Alright. Reloading this is pointless, but why not? Alright, head on up. <laughs> I love, I actually really like this camo. It's really good looking. It's a good looking camo. Oh, the B-115 Accelerator. Oh, 360. Let's see if I can't do a 360. <clears throat> that was awesome. I should be a professional COD player. I'd be so good. I'd be like number one MLG, if that's a thing. Is that a thing? I hope that's a thing. I'd be number one MLG. Boom. Alright, let's try out the B-115 Accelerator. AKA the Browning M1919. Running circles is difficult when you're running around where they spawn. I'll be quite honest, it makes it more difficult. It'd be different if it was, like, just two doorways, but when they're coming out of the ground, I mean, you can kind of run around it, but it makes it a little bit more difficult. It'd be different if it was one rising place. This, that's from, like, what, three spawn? Three spawn windows? Just coming out of the ground right there. Alright. Mow them down. Ooh, Insta. Double, double points. Get in that knife. Yeah. Alright, so, playing zombies solo is pretty much no fun. Uh, but I don't really have any friends that have either A, the computers, or B, the game. Because, <laughs> you know, they're not a fan or something. So if you guys want to play, I'll do community stuff. Uh, hook me up on Steam. Just look up Keytor and you'll find it. You'll find me. Just look for the person that's got, like almost a hundred hours on Call of Duty World at War.
you'll find it. Um, so yeah, if you have me up on Steam, I'll probably, you know, I'll do some playing with you. Alright. This is getting to be a long game. I'm actually surprised that Matt lasted this long. I'm lasting this long, I should say. Oh, can't stand here. Why could I not stand there? That was almost unfortunate. I told ya I wasn't on the menu. My favorite, my favorite of the four people you play as is Tank Dempsey, because he is the only Nazi zombie character to break the fourth wall. Um, I've noticed in the past. I don't know if he says this on other maps, but on Kino, on Black Ops One, he says, "Hey player, drop the chips and get me some ammo." He actually breaks the fourth wall. He realizes he's in a video game, which I think is awesome. I don't know if that's, like, just a small little thing, like, not intended to mean anything, or if it's, like, in-depth, like, all of this is in the head of somebody, and really, you're playing a video game of somebody playing a video game, uh, symbolizing that Tank is actually you know, a part of a thing, so he is the reason, the reason he knows is because, you know, he's being controlled by someone else, and he's not actually saying anything. Conspiracy theory. My little rant about the storyline. Although it probably means nothing. That's all I gotta say. But yeah, he breaks the fourth wall, and that's why he's my favorite. I'm getting tired of using the browning. I'm getting too many points. Alright, let's see if we can't get a crawler. Oh, that was a bad throw. It's going to blow up right there. Pretty much. Oh, I'm bad at getting crawlers. Right, we're going to give this one more try, because that's all we can do, isn't it? Please tell me. Yes. Ouch. You know, I think one thing this map could go for is, I understand it's meant to be a challenge, but I think there should be more wall weapons. I mean, there's really only one, and I expected that coming into the map, but there's only one. <laughs> That's kind of a big deal. What's this? Why are there more than one? I don't know. I'll link them. Maybe it's an easter egg. Maybe I'm actually doing an easter egg here. Did that do anything? Oh, there's one more. Teleporter is cooling down. Initiate it. Something happened. I don't know where it happened, but something did happen. Come on, bro. What happened? Something up here? 
I really have no clue. Surely that did something, right? That's unfortunate. There's zombies driving cars. Yeah, I don't think there's a buyable. If there was, I would definitely have a goal to go towards. I feel like I just completed an easter egg, but... I heard a sound. It made a sound when I linked the third one. Hmm. Alright, whatever. You thirsty partner? <laughs> yeah, partner. Tank. What a dude. Why is this door not openable? Surely that was an Easter egg. Hi, friend. Are there, like, teddy bears or something? This map really needs more substance to it. I mean, there's perks, there's a box, there's a pack of punch. Every map has that. It needs something unique, like, you know, an Easter egg. Every Easter egg, even if they're the same concept, are at least a little bit unique, because you have to look around. You don't exactly know what form it's going to be in. Uh, they're harder to do. But, you know, I'm not seeing anything. Look at that third teleporter made a noise. I just don't know what it was supposed to do. And quite frankly, I'm confused. <laughs> but it looks like we genuinely did finish the map, and so I think I'm gonna end the video here. I think I'm just gonna go have the crawler down me. That'll be the end. So I hope you guys enjoyed this series. If you did, series, this video, if you did, drop that like button and subscribe. It means a lot to me personally, and I hope it means a lot to you to have spent the time to watch this video because I enjoyed making it and I would enjoy making more so I'll see you guys next time after I kill myself why don't you kill yourself can this guy literally not kill me is this going anywhere I don't think this is going anywhere Alright. Here we go. We're in standby window. <laughs> Since that didn't work. Oh, it's a dog round. Great. Great. At least they can actually kill me. Hey, buddy. Would you mind? See you guys next time. I hope you enjoyed the video. Drop that like, subscribe button. See you next time. Bye bye.